Bar is partnering up with the YMCA to get the party started ahead of a very tasty upcoming fundraiser. This is where we find Fox 4 East Tony Salazar at the Cabin Bar in Sacramento to see what they have planned for National S'mores Day. It is the YMCA's largest fundraiser of the year, and we're here in Midtown Sacramento at the cabin, enjoying their cozy atmosphere they got going on. This is also where I do want to go to bring in Miss Sierra right here with, with YMCA. But we got Miss Allison, who's going to be shaking things up, preparing for a s'mores, a cocktail, and so much more. So thanks so much for being here with us. Let's talk more about YMCA and how you all support our children in our community. Absolutely. So every year we have an event called S'mores Fest. It's s'mores themed. We've coined the term camp for adults. Um, and all of the funding that we raise, it's our largest fundraiser of the year, goes towards our Y Assist Scholarship Fund, which provides discounted programs and services um, at the YMCA for those co who could not otherwise afford it. That is amazing. So definitely a worthy cause here, Sierra. Tell me more about the event itself. This is only weeks away. Yes, absolutely. It's September 28th at the YMCA on our field. And every year we have about five what we call s'more makers. The cabin is one of them. And they come and make their version of a s'more that you can try. And then you can vote for this year's s'more of the year. Oh, so if you love s'mores, you're going to want to listen up to this. What is the goal for this year? Is there a goal for this year? Because this is, event is taking place in our community for many years now. Yes, I believe it's the... Um, 11th or 12th year that S'mores Fest has been going on, so a while. Last year we raised $100,000, so our goal this year is to beat that. Awesome, awesome. And Miss Allison, I'm going to bring you into our conversation. You are shaking things up. What are you making here? I am making our signature S'mores cocktail. It contains a Smirnoff whipped vodka, creme de cacao, and a little bit of half and half. And again, this cocktail has s'mores, has all the delicious fluffy marshmallows and so many other treats that are going to be available this weekend. And what are we about to do, Miss Sierra, right now? We're going to try it. Oh, we are going to try it. We have Miss Allison pouring it into a nice, beautiful glass. You got the marshmallow, and it's, don't worry, she's not even done. What are you about to do right now? We're going to fly a little flight. Yeah, a little fire goes along. Wait, look at this. Ooh-wee. All right, Miss Sierra, jump in here. All Let's right, grab a glass and cheers. Ooh, that's still on fire. Okay, okay. <laughs> here you go. Thank that's you. still on fire. Ooh, there we go. All right, and with that being said, this can be you. Of course, you got to be 21 or older to enjoy a nice alcoholic beverage here. But with that being said, cheers to a successful yeah. event. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Good. If you love sweet, if you love marshmallows, I got it all over my lips. This can be you at the event. We'll have all the details on our website at fox40.com if you'd like to attend. For now, reporting in Midtown, Sacramento. Covering local news that matters. Tony Salazar, Fox 40 News. Oh, looks delicious. Jello.